Um, tasting coffees is very much like tasting wines. There's a large variety of different characters. People are very surprised at the, the large range of different flavors. Uh, some of the coffees, depending on how you roast it, what color you roast it at, you know, you can get real nice chocolate and mocha taste out of them. Um, some just taste like plain old coffee, I do, so. Uh, we're generally tasting coffee from about 8 o'clock in the morning, sometimes up through 5 o'clock. For one single bean, if it was to run all the way through the system, it could probably be done in about 30 minutes. After the cooling process takes place, uh, the coffee will then go uh, back up into a silo system and it will be directed to one of the grinders. And from the ground silos, we will then transfer the coffee into large uh, sacks. The, the final confirmation of it is through a tasting process. Uh, we physically roast and taste everything uh, that we bring into the building. Coffee is a really a male-dominated industry, but we, I mean, at Dilema, have always had women in significant roles. Ella DeLima is actually the one who founded Paul DeLima Coffee. It was her son Paul who incorporated it in 1916. They went to Brazil, she brought back a bag of green coffee, and in her kitchen she hooked up a bike to a cement mixer, flame under it, would ride and would roast the coffee. And that's where we came up with the idea for Ella's. It's kind of a way to pay tribute to her.